My Lynn Lake adventure started in Winnipeg, Manitoba with Wayne and my son Darren, where we met up with U.S. walleye pro Ted Takasaki to board Comair, who was flying us up to Thompson, Manitoba. Before we knew it, we were up in the air and settling in for a two-hour flight. But lucky for us, Comair supplied a few snacks and a lunch during the flight. Oh, thank you. <laughs> By the time the flight attendant managed to wrestle the food away from me, we were landed in Thompson. Then we boarded a Lynn Lake charter plane that was going to take us the rest of the way. The flight was just about an hour long and when we arrived there was a welcoming party at the airport ready to greet us, including the mayor himself, Adi Delowich. As some of us headed to our cabins to get unpacked, the rest headed to the Tourist Information Building to talk with the Community Economic Development Officer and the man behind arranging this trip, Mark Matasak, about Lynn Lake. Uh, Lynn Lake, it's a, uh, a rural remote community, um, about uh, three and a half hours from Thompson, Manitoba, about approximately 12 hours from uh, Winnipeg, the capital of Manitoba. Um, we're up here, um, literally at the end of the road, surrounded by some pristine nature, tremendous number of lakes and rivers, sporting a variety of quality uh, fishing, ranging from walleye to northern pike, uh, lake trout and waters are cold and clear, uh, ranging from a large body of water to small little uh, potholes and teeming with pickerel. All right, nice walleye. 